This is 100% human hair, Brazilian hair, of course. And the curls are so lovely. Look at that, guys. Look at that. Hi, guys. This is Marie Tico here again, bringing you another hair tip tutorial. So I, you guys are probably wondering, why does she just have a wig cap on? Because today I'm going to show you how to put on a lace front sole unit with the Gatsby glue. Yeah? And I'm going to try and make this, well, here guys. <laughs> I'm going to try and make this as simple as possible for you guys to understand, okay? So first, I have, um, you... If you have a lot of hair, you can just braid the hair down. But if you don't have any hair, you can just go go ahead and just put the cap on, okay? So basically, I put her cap on, and we got a cap that was close to her skin as as possible. And now we're using her foundation to put on top of the cap. So we're gonna put that on top of the cap like this. And this step, you can do like every day, every day if you have the time though. <laughs> so I'm gonna put it on her hair. We're doing this because I didn't bleach the the knots on the lace frontal. So that's why we're doing this. And it honestly, it works the same. I like it. Use, first we're gonna put it on, I've curled it already. I've curled the wig already, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> I've curled the wig already, so basically, I'm going to, and it has an elastic band at the back, and this is the lace frontal. I've actually put makeup on here too as well. So I'm going to put it on her. Can you hold the front for me? Get on that. Okay. So that's that. I customized it for her, so I took her measurements and then I made the wig for her head. That's why it's fitting so seamlessly. And look, you guys, it's not going anywhere. So I've curled it already. And for now, I am now about to put glue gel <laughs> on her hair. But before I do that, I'm going to use 99%, I'm going to use 91% alcohol remover from where I'm going to apply the guts of the glue gel on. I'm going to use a towel. If you guys can see, I'm going to use a, a towel and put some of the alcohol on there. And then I'm going to lift this part up. You can do this before you put the lace frontal on, but I like to do it while. You can do it while before you put it on, but I'm doing it like this. Just like remove any oils that's there so that the glue, the got sweet glue can stick there. Easy. The extra lace off. So we're gonna just follow her hairline here. Can you turn right here. And you're just gonna do straight across. Not straight across though, you guys. You're gonna follow her, your hairline. And it's really advisable if you use a sharp scissors. My scissors is pretty sharp, so it gets the job done. And it's literally that easy, guys. So now we're gonna bring back her hair. We're gonna bring back the flap of the hair over here. This flap. Clean it a bit more if you need. I got to be glue. Put it at the back of my hands. Make sure the back of your hands is clean too. So, you can use a little bit of the alcohol 
alcohol and then put it at the back of your hands to make sure that to make sure that to make sure sorry <laughs> that there's no oils there okay let it dry it dries out pretty quick so don't worry about that and just put a decent amount in there on your hands because you're going to need all of it see you them out so then you're going to apply it with your hands and then you're going to do one layer first and you're going to do this three two more times so you apply three layers and when when you use a dryer let it be on um cool on cool let the air that comes out of the dryer be cool and put it on high speed okay so we have done three layers of this now you know that it's done when you put i'm going to zoom in right close when you put the comb there and it sticks up like this it's like tacky okay that's when you know it's done all right okay you guys so now i'm putting the lace on her hair and this is the side of her hair and basically at this point i just put it down like this and then just like have the baby hair come over i will do another video where i do more in depth baby hair how to do them but today i just really wanted you guys to see how i lay down the lace closures then you put it over it what that does is it hardens the hair and it makes this thing in place it works guys try that so after you have glued the hair with your got to be glued gel um, you would then of course use the spritz like I showed you earlier to set the gel but after you put the spritz on you find that the hair is a bit white no worries that's why you see me using my towel it's actually wet with water and um, I'm using it to clean up any white residue before I use my wrapping paper which you you can get at Sally's. So, yeah. Make sure that after you get the spritz, you clean it up with a wet... You clean out all the white substance with a wet towel. So, I comb down all the hair down, and I put a wrapping paper in the front. So, I'm quickly going to just take it out so you guys can see the finished results. Okay, there we go. <laughs> so, this is the finished results, you guys. I hope that you guys love it. So go ahead, like, and subscribe. This is a frontal with only two bundles, okay, you guys? Two bundles and a closure. Just go ahead and write me on the comments below. On, on um, below the video on the comment section and I will so answer it for you guys. So this is the finished result. Do you like? Touch your hair, Yolanda. Okay guys. And this hair, I provide this hair too. too. And I made the wig myself. So as you see, this hair is so beautiful. It curls so great. And leave me your comments. Let me know how what you think, what you've learned. Um, I will leave all the contacts to my hairline, to my social media down below. And thank you guys for watching. Love you all. Bye.